Good morning. Welcome to a special edition of the Raider Nation 2018. Joining us today are two faculty members who would like to share their experiences. Joining us first today in the studio is Mr. Rosati. Mr. Rosati, how are you doing today? Very good, how are you? Thank you, I'm good. With the world in constant turmoil as we turn to a new year, how has your experience in Africa put it in perspective? That's a big question. There's a lot I could say. Uh, the, I'll, I'll just mention a couple things, though. Uh, when I was in Africa, I experienced, I had the experience of meeting the locals, the people who lived, live in Djibouti, and uh, they don't have much there. Mm -hmm. It's a developing nation, um, and what I found was the people were actually very happy. So I thought that was a surprising thing to see, but uh, if, you, if you study the people in Somalia, uh, they every day are fighting for their lives. Uh, they're constantly concerned about explosions, uh, IEDs, uh, the kids don't have such good lives. So uh, it's really put in perspective for me how great we have it here in America. And uh, my one piece of advice to anyone that doesn't think they have it good here is to go to a country like that to Djibouti or to Somalia or to Afghanistan, and you quickly realize how, how uh, blessed you are here. So, How special was this holiday season being home with your family? Oh, it was great. Uh, obviously, last year I was away, so uh, it was very nice to spend time with family and uh, friends. And uh, it, again, it really makes you appreciate family being away, so uh, it was a great, great time. How has your experience in 2017 affect your resolution for 2018? Based on what I experienced overseas, uh, it's changed me in the sense that I have a much deeper appreciation for how good I have it here in America. And I, I count my blessings every day. I get on my knees and I thank God every day for all the blessings. So it's really changed my perspective on life. Thank you, Mr. Rosati, for joining us in the studio. We hope that your 2018 will be special for you and your family. Coming up next, Alexa Arcuti talks with Ms. Dono. Thank you, Gianna, and welcome to the show, Ms. Dono. With the new year upon us, trials and tribulations that you faced in 2017 will surely last a lifetime. Can you explain to our viewers what a new year means to you? I think a new year means to me and it sounds cliche, but it's a fresh start. It's a new year, it's a new outlook, it's a new attitude, it's, it's really just an opportunity. I agree. This time of the year, people look for a New Year's resolution. Can you explain to us how your experience from 2017 has shed the light on your 2018 resolution? My 2018 resolution is to not sweat the small stuff and to not invest energies into things that I can't change. And I think it's hard and it's easy to say, and sometimes I get caught up in it. But I learned last year through everything that we've been through, my family, myself personally, and even with my students, is that a lot of times we stress over like the tiniest things in life that mm -hmm. in a year aren't even going to matter. And we don't really vest our energies and our thoughts and you know um, our commitments into things that actually do matter. And that's kind of my goal is to be able to like tell the difference between those and not sweat the small stuff anymore. That's definitely a good outlook to have. If you had one message for our viewers on what they can do to make someone's life better, what would it be? I would say, mm, and I know it sounds horrible to a certain degree, but putting yourself second. There's a lot of people in this world that are going through things and carrying things on their shoulders that you can make their life better by just doing a simple act of kindness, whether it's saying hello in the morning or bringing them a cup of coffee. Like, it doesn't have to be monumentous, but to think of yourself second and others first. And I think if more people did that, it would change our world and make it a better place. So that's kind of my advice. I agree. Thank you. For Gianna Signorelli, I'm Alexa Arcudi, and we hope that 2018 is special for all of our viewers. 